we've now been focusing a lot of our effort on studies with much more short-term practice, uh, where we work with people who've never meditated before, and we have them go through various kinds of training to learn different kinds of practices, and we test them before and after, and then follow up uh, to see what the impact is. And those studies have been very, very important for, for, this, for a scientific perspective, even though they don't show the kind of dramatic differences that we've seen when we compare long-term practitioners to controls. Um, but in these longitudinal studies, we can see that a person who meditates for even just two weeks, 30 minutes a day, is, shows a different pattern of brain activity than when they started two weeks before. And that is really important because it suggests that the brain really is plastic, that we really can make these changes, and that it actually doesn't take that much. Uh, and in one study we published in 2013 using a simple secular form of compassion meditation practice, we found that 30 minutes a day of practice for two weeks, a total of seven hours of practice, was sufficient to change the brain in very objective, measurable ways.